Introducing you to some unique places featured in a new book called 100 Things to Do in Buffalo Before You Die. Yesterday we took you to Viddler's, of course a staple in East Aurora. This morning we're taking you to a creative workshop space that also functions as a museum and a space for you to learn some new skills like how to make your own paper. 7 Eyewitness News reporter Twila Nugent is taking us to Western New York Books and Arts Center this morning in downtown Buffalo. Hey Twila, good morning to you. Good morning, Ed and Katie. I'll admit this place is downtown. It's right on the corner of Mohawk and Washington, but I've passed it by a couple times and I had no idea what was inside and I'm disappointed in myself for not stopping. We've got Mel here with us this morning to tell us a little bit about what it is you guys do here at the Western New York Book Arts Center. So we're the Western New York Book Arts Center. We're an arts educational nonprofit dedicated to preserving the art of printmaking and bookmaking. Um, we function as a gallery space for local artists, a studio for working artists to come and use our equipment, and we also have a retail gift shop where we focus on um, regional artists who sell a um, bunch of products in our store. So there's uh, yeah. lots of posters, um, hand printed cards, hand printed um, t shirts, and apparel, even little book necklaces, like little books to wear on your neck. That's um, so cute. Why is it so important for you guys to support the community and these local artists? Um, I think being able to, you know, preserve the art of printmaking and just show the community, you know, what is possible, what you can do with handmade items, and also keeping that art alive, and that's what we can show in our merchandise and what we create here. Absolutely, and it's so interesting because we've done some of the activities, actually. Can we walk over here really quick for a second? Because I do want to mention there are Mother's Day cards on this side as well as graduation cards, so it's the perfect season to come get them. They're reasonably priced. They're so adorable and they're made here pretty much locally. Correct. Yeah. So about half the items here are made by over 75 local artists and half the items are made by our staff here using our presses downstairs. And you guys offer classes for those presses, right? Correct. Yep. We have classes in letterpress printing, screen printing, as well as bookmaking, paper making, origami arts, a lot of different workshops and classes for all ages. Pretty much. So anything you see here, you can pretty much learn how to do. And I highly suggest it because the staff here is so kind, so smart, and everything is so fun to see, especially nowadays when we're so tied to our phones and screens. It's kind of nice just to take a step back and do it the old-fashioned way. We're live here in downtown Buffalo. I'm Twila Nugent, 7 Eyewitness News. A very good point. Yes, Twila, thank you very much. Okay.